I mean, you can't sort of take it away from people. Otherwise, you can have herds of disenfranchised, disillusioned, and diseased mentally, you know, people out there, you know, because, you know, we're only just out of the tree. That's why we get backache, because we've only just getting used to walking on two legs. You know, they're, they're just pushing it. The whole global thing is, has gone too far, and there's no one's in control of it. And um, that's why, you know, I'm running this ego worry thing, because the, the, it's just in a gentle way, if you remind yourself of, uh, you know, being an individual, it's, it's, it's you, my, my, and you should take more, you know, defend your self-esteem. Because uh, if you don't defend your self-esteem, you're no use to anybody else, and it's all going to go down the pan. The, the, what, what, and how, you know, it's not easy to sort of encapsulate it into a soundbite. But if, you know, you, you like, like, let me say, the, the show that I'm doing now, it's called A People's Guide to World Domination. Well, break it down, you know, people. What are people? There are no pe perfect people in the world, only us. What is the world? It's actually... The word world comes from Old German and Latin, wir, meaning man, and alt or alt, meaning age. So it's age of man or human existence. That's the world. And that's more like, you know, what we're talking about earlier, reality. And if you come to domination, that is basically power and control. In the dictionary, it says over others, but surely you should have power and control over yourself, you know. And so. Actually, don't look up domination on Google. You'll get you'll get lots of offers for housewives, lonely housewives. Yeah, you under, uh, uh, like a woods. Well, yeah. <laughs> but the story of all time is um, uh, the Count of Monte Cristo, by Alexander Dumas. Um, he's in prison on this island for something he hasn't done, and he's beaten up every year on his birthday, and uh, but after eight years or something. A stone moves in his cell floor and a head comes through and it's this fellow prisoner, a priest, who's been tunnelling in the wrong direction for ten years. <laughs> but he teaches him, he educates him and what have you. And the memorable line is, they may take away your freedom, but they cannot take away your knowledge. And so it's up to everybody to reclaim knowledge and actually Think about how big the solar system is and how small all the atoms and the microatoms and things are. And then look at the rest of it, it's all hooey.